I'm Canadian Wong and I'm an illustrator and artist here in Hong Kong. Today I've set up here in this really, really busy area in Hong Kong called TSD, Sim Sa Choi. We're at the Star Ferry Pier and there's like tons of people here. It's a really nice day and I hope that people will like come and sit down and I can do their portrait and they can bring more art and creativity to people. Whether it's tourists or like friends I've invited. Just like people pass by. I just want them to like come and like look at some art and then brighten up their day. This is like the first time I'm trying it. I'm just testing it out. I've got all my paint brushes here and I've got my business card, my palette, I've got all my gouache. This is the big one. This is the one I use at home, but I just brought it. It has like all the colors that I use. I've got some really dirty water for my watercolors, some samples. You can see I've even made a sign. It's like watercolor bunting sign. I made this acrylic palette to use. I think it looks really good because it's clear. And the donation box, so like if you want to get their portrait done, they can give me a few bucks for the paper. I almost never draw boys, so I never know like do I give them blush? <laughs> When I was really little, I always was like, I'm going to be a fashion designer when I grow up. That's like always what I wanted to be. When I graduated, I worked at Lee & Chung. So I did assistant fashion design there for one year. And I really decided it's like, it's not for me. Like, it's like a lot of coordinating, like a lot of like emails and like chasing after clients. It was like very difficult for me because I'm not very good at coordinating things. Like I like to work alone most of the time. When I just came to Hong Kong yeah. years ago, I was researching a local artist. Yeah. And I found you back then. Oh, that's so cool. I really love your style. Well, I love to draw girls. Girls are dressed with lots of pattern and color. It's my favorite thing to draw patterns. But to, I guess today I'm doing very quick sketches. So probably can't be too intricate, but yeah, bright colors, I love that. Oh, this is fabulous! <laughs> Thank you! I love the style, it's kind of like 60s and more into like old illustration. It has this charm, it's really light, watercolors, and like, yeah, I like it a lot. I saw her work on Sassy Hong Kong and I also have a friend who introduced me as well. And then I saw that she was having this stall here in front of the Star Ferry Pier on Facebook. And so I came right away. I'm really excited. I've never had anybody draw me like live before, so it's pretty cool. So as I'm a freelance illustrator, so I'm always at home and um, it's really boring. Like I'm always looking at my computer drawing photos that I like. So I really want to like go out and like draw from life. And I want to take advantage of Hong Kong because there's like not really like busking regulations. I'm from Toronto and if you want to bus there, you have to get a permit. But in Hong Kong, it's really free. You just set up. If you're not disturbing people, then you're free to do whatever you like. So I thought it'd be really good to take advantage of that. My inspiration is fashion. I'm mostly inspired by fashion. Everything that I see around me, uh, like street style, different like other artists. I like to go out to the exhibitions here in Hong Kong a lot just to get inspired by what other artists do. I love it, it's really cool and I really like Kiki's work and it's fashionable, I like the eyes especially. <laughs> we are very happy, yeah. We got our own illustration from Kitty. It's my first portrait actually. On my business card there's this there's this woman, her name is Kat Marnell. She's a writer in New York. She's like a very, very crazy writer. So she like parties all the time. She writes about makeup and then she kind of ties it all together. So I like when people's personality leaches into their work and creates an interesting mix. So I'm inspired by people like that. I love it. I've always wanted one. <laughs> it looks like me. I like the colors. I think it's brilliant. Pretty good likeness. She's very talented. It's great. It's it's more classy than I am. <laughs> Welcome to your picture. Thank you. She 
has a very um, coherent and persistent dial that you can tell is pretty warm. It's very quick and fun. I'm busy proposing to my you know, future wife if I'm lucky enough. It's a definite yes. <laughs> this is uh, capturing the moment uh, of one of the most important moments of my life that I found my future the other half. So, super happy. But I'm really happy for Kitty to do this. I've admired her work for ages and we saw this opportunity. I just thought it a beautiful way to tell everyone um, where our lives go. So, thank you very much for that.